The scene is recognized instantly by any Star Wars fan. The movie Star Wars has this very famous scene of Luke Skywalker walking out to contemplate his future uh, around a double sunset in his uh, planetary system. And uh, that's a, a science fiction visualization of what was thought to be possible. Double sunsets are not only possible, NASA scientists now believe the universe could be full of them. More than half of all stars are twins, outnumbering single stars like our sun. The suns we knew would be there. The question was, was there a planet uh, to uh, be the place where you could stand and see these sunsets? And the inference is getting stronger now that there, there must be such planets based on what Spitzer has found. NASA Spitzer Space Telescope, with its infrared eye, can detect clues to locations of planets. It spots dusty disks, material around stars that's left over when planets are formed. What we did here differently was that we, we didn't look for the planets directly. Instead, we looked for dust. This dust gives off heat. It can be detected with the Spitzer Space Telescope. Those are an indirect indicator, the dust particles. They're an indirect indicator of an asteroid belt. And asteroids are leftovers from the formation of rocky planets like the Earth. So we can, by a chain of reasoning, say, I see dust particles, therefore there's an asteroid belt there, therefore there's a high chance of rocky planets like the Earth being in that system. The astronomers also discovered that not all double star or binary systems are friendly places for planets to form. The systems most likely to have them are twins situated far apart from each other or those found close together. The tight binaries we find are most likely to have orbiting material, uh, asteroids, comets, and we're guessing that they're the most likely systems to have planets. This uh, planet Tatooine may be very normal. It seemed very unusual and exotic, uh, something very different than our own system, but that doesn't mean it's necessarily unusual. So planets like ours with a single sun dipping below the horizon each night might be even less common in the cosmos than the dull sunset scene in Star Wars.